hello guys welcome back to the channel today we are solving another lead code problem that is 436 find ride interval before jumping into the solution i would highly recommend you should read the problem statement on your own and give at least 15 to 30 minutes before jumping into the solution so let's get right into it what problem is asking that you need to find the right interval what do i mean by right interval let's take an example let's take 2 comma 3 we have to find the right interval for 2 comma 3 and give an interval r as follows let me write it for you yeah so the right interval is the one whose start is greater than let me write it whose whose start is greater than equal to the end of i let me repeat start is greater than and equal to end if we take this i if we take this j so start j should be greater than end i so that end what we have to return is the index so if it is 0 1 2 so for this interval what is the right interval 0 th the interval present at the 0th index so that is problem asking that is what you need to do so let's see how we gonna do it what is the thing that we have to do while explaining the problem you should have guessed that we are or while reading the problem also you should have guessed that we are searching something that that this end this end the end of i the end of i is there any j what do you mean by j uh, interval whose start is greater than the end of i not not only greater than equal to the end so so how we're gonna approach this we have to find that this end is someone greater than this end greater than or equal to this end so we have to have start so first concern is our start and we need to find search in something search in the start so while we do search what is the is the go to algorithm binary search binary search but as you can see interval are not sorted so how are we gonna apply it and also we have to only search the first so what we can do is map what map does is it sorts its key and we can store here we store the start and here we store index at which index and which interval this start is present so this problem of sorting of data is cured and why we use map first reason is to have start plus its index and also start is sorted so that's why and also to binary search over it so that's why map and by binary search because we are searching this is there any start which is greater than or equal to our end we are searching this so we that's why we are putting this inside our map now so what is left for you to understand is how we gonna do binary search we will be using lower bound why lower bound as you can see we are searching greater than or equal to and if you have read about lower bound you know what it returns iterator of element greater than or equal to the x where x is the searched searched element 
isn't it in lower bound we get a iterator of element and that element can be greater than and equal to and if equal is present then we get equal and if it is not present then we get greater if present we get equal if not present we get if not present we get greater so that's what is we are asking over here if it is present we get it if it is if the end is not present what we get start greater start so that's why lower bound is applied and what we do if we get something out of this and if it is not the map end and if it is not the map end what does it mean we just push it in the vector vector the index and if if it is not equal to the end and if it is equal to the end if it is equal to the m dot end what does it mean it doesn't have any right interval so what we push is vector minus one in vector in vector minus one so our algo is very simple uh why it is scrolling upward scroll it down algo very simple what we are doing map int comma int how are we gonna fill it with start and with the respective index uh, scroll it a bit uh, yeah that's what we are doing this much and we binary search over it binary search over the before this one step also not necessary but still i will let me erase it again that is quite underst understandable but i will still mention it i trade over the over the intervals and what to do take the end and do bs binary search on the map take the end to the binary search how are we gonna do binary search lower bound lower bound so if we get something if it is equals to m dot end push minus one because nothing is found if it is not equal to that push the index whichever index that is present so algo is pretty much clear pretty straightforward let's take an example and finish it as soon as possible why so that you you can watch more questions and do more questions so so we are mapping three the first three is present at zero two is present at one and one is present at two zero one two let me write it clearly how it is mapped inside the map sorted sorted map now iterate iterate not interval iterate iterate over the intervals first we take three comma four what we are taking the four and we search do we have something less than can we find four no what we get greater than four greater than four we get the end and if we get the end what we do push minus one now it's two comma three now we take two comma three we take three search it over here is it present yeah it is present what we do 
prints push its index we did now let's take one comma two is two present yeah it is over here push it that's it that's all the intervals same output so i hope it is clear let's see the code this is the map as discussed filling the map with the first the start with the index yeah the result vector iterating over the intervals and this is iterator that we will be getting from the lower bound and this is how we do lower bound over map not lower bound binary search using lower bound over map so you can search about this syntax on your own so this what we are searching is the end only so yeah if iterator points to the end what we should do is push back minus one else what we should do is uh, what we should do the index and in the interval itr dot second in the binary search you will get this this in the binary search you will get this whole thing what we need is this this only that's why itr dot second so that much is pretty clear we gonna do it again and again till we have the interval and after that just return it return the result let's submit it if it is running or not yeah it is running so i hope i was able to make the intuition understandable to you if i was consider subscribing to this channel liking this video sharing with your friends and you have to do what you have to do so keep grinding grinding and you guys are awesome see you in the next one bye bye